Friday, give this government your answer. Vote them out. Vote for the Fine Gael candidates. Vote for the Fine Gael teams. Because you are not just voting for the candidates, you're voting for your own families, you're voting for your children's future, you're voting about your country. We want to send Brian Cowan and his cabinet a message, a strong message. They have misled the Irish people, they have betrayed their confidence, they have wasted billions of your money, and the time has come to cry halt. I hope that this precipitates a general election, because in my view, this box is about to go. We need a new government with a new mandate to take this country in a new direction. I am prepared to lead this party in the next government and sort out the problems of our nation, as I know that Fine Gael did in the past and as I know we will in the future. So people of Mallow and surrounding districts, you've got a superb team here. Great people. Get out there until 10 o'clock on Friday night and don't give an inch, because we mean to sort out the problems of our country on this occasion, but we need your imprimatur and we need your message. Thank you very much. Right on my hands, I need every voter of Cork City and Cork County to stay in the race and to win the second seat. Because the Senate and Minster the last time, we couldn't win two or three. We can win two or three in this constituency of our itself, but we need every vote. We need your friends' votes, we need your relations' votes, we need your neighbours' votes, and above all, we need your votes. Because we are the biggest group in the European Parliament, we have the most to offer, and we have most influence. And that's why I think you should go out and work extremely hard for this party over the next three days. I've worked hard over the last two years in Europe, in working in relation to jobs, in relation to healthcare, in relation to agriculture. And this time, it's amazing how we have a government that has sat idly by and watched the agricultural industry go down the chute. It has done very little for it, but it should have been putting pressure on the European Commission to come in and give the necessary support which it needs. It's amazing, you know, how the Commissioner has sat back over the last 12 months and watched instability come in to the agricultural industry. We need major decisions taken at European level. We need those decisions now not in 12 months time when a whole lot of other farmers have gone out of business. That's why people should go out and vote for the Fine Gael candidates, why they should vote for them at local level and at European level. We have set out quite clearly in Fine Gael our policies in relation to healthcare, in relation to jobs, in relation to education. Quite clearly we know what the future decisions that have to be taken in this country. This government have been in power for far too long. This is the first step in getting them out. So I'm asking you to come out on June the 5th and vote for the Fine Gael candidates for the European and local elections. So the first step forward is the next general election in Cork East that we can come back and deliver two Fine Gael seats in Cork East, two seats in Cork Northwest, three seats in Cork South Central, two seats in Cork Southwest, and two seats in Cork North Central. That's the aim for the next general election. This is the first step. You play your part by getting every vote out on June the 5th and getting your candidates elected. Thank you very much indeed.